Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Go High Level with Vateep. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to set up a dedicated domain for email in a Go High Level sub account. This is an important step to ensure your emails are sent from a domain that represents your brand and increase your email deliverability. So let's get started. The very first step is to make sure you are logged in to your Go High Level account and the domain provider, whoever the domain provider is. It could be GoDaddy or Namecheap. In my case, I'm using Namecheap. And the second step is once you are logged into your Go High Level account, go to settings and domains. So make sure you have already connected your domain. If you have not, make sure to watch my first video where I have already showed you how you can connect your domain. And the second step is to you need to come here to email services. In email services, you need to set up a dedicated domain. So what you can do here is at the domain, let's say I'm gonna set up a mail dot. In my case, the email I want to set up a dedicated domain for is topnossolutions.com. So come back here. I'm, I'm using mail.topnossolutions.com. Say add and verify. Once you do that, you need you invalid domain, let's say, okay. So once you do that, you're gonna get MX records and DNS records from here. So use that. Take that from here, copy them and put them exactly as they are into your domain providers. So I'm coming here to my domain provider. I'm gonna go to advanced DNS. Once you go to advanced DNS, yeah, so you're gonna put here by the time your, yeah, it's TXT is ready, CNAME is ready, MX records are ready. So copy the TXT, copy here, come back here. The host was you can also skip this part if you want. So this is how we just gonna copy paste here. Everything one by one, make sure not to make any mistake, but it's not a big deal if you do. C name is ready, then MX records. This is the part. Uh, where many people say they cannot find MX. So what you need to do is that come here, say custom MX. Once you do that, you can find it here. Host is mail. And then this is the mail server. Priority, I'm doing 10. Why? Because I've been doing for so many times. So this is what I choose. Save. Come back here, it's mail. Card. Yeah. Priority, choose 10 again. Come back here. Since we have added everything, now you can hit verify records. Once you do that, it's gonna verify. It's gonna take few seconds to a minute. So we before we did not verify this one. So it's it's once you hit verify, it's gonna come up. So copy this one again. It was a TXT. I'm gonna go back here. Hit one TXT. Host is this one, and the value was. Here it is. 
come back here hit verify again and here is it guys it is ready so now here is another step if you want to if you want to make sure where what the what the receiver will see once you will send an email uh, you can set it up here the headers so headers you can say uh, top nosh solutions and the email if whatever the email you want to you want your receiver to see you can write it down here let's say you want them to see info at top nosh solutions.com you can write it here and great it is ready so what is happening right now when, whenever you are sending email actually the email is going from here and but the header will be this hope guys that helps and um, if you need anything please let me know if you want to see more videos about any stuff let me know and make sure subscribe and like so i will be making more videos in the future thank you